that evening, the house began to die. Smoking glass. Somebody break the glass. The wind blew the bow of a fallen tree into the kitchen window, smashing it. A bottle of cleaning fluid crashed on the stove. Oh, voices. Fire! Fire! shot down from the ceiling, but the solvent spread under the doors, oh, making making fire as it went. <laughs> other voices and other rooms taking up the alarm. Help! And the wind blew in to help the fire. Harsh wind blowing. The fire crackled upstairs. At paintings lay hungrily on the beds. Devoured the rooms. The house began to shudder. It says sound house shudder. It's going. There we go. The bared skeleton began to cringe in the heat. The wires revealed as if a surgeon had torn the skin off. Voices screamed in every room. The one voice Windows snapped open and shut. Like undecided mouths. <laughs> the time is now ten ten. 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 A thousand things were happening at once, like the interior of a clock shop at midnight. All the clocks were striking, making a merry-go-round of sweeping, whispering, and rushing. In the kitchen, the stove, hissing hysterically, was making, was making breakfast at a psychopathic rate. Ten dozen pancakes, six dozen loaves of toast, obviously it's con. In the con suite. In the con suite, yes. Stove and everything else slows to a stop. Then there was silence. Not this room. <laughs> the film spools were burned out. The wires withered and the circuits cracked. Crack! Yeah. <laughs> Much like this battle. Yeah. And then the house began to breathe its last. <laughs> <laughs> the beams began to give way at the foundations. Long cracks appeared in the concrete. The seams were burst from the heat, and finally, with a huge rumble, it crashed into dust and rubble. <laughs> and then the sun comes out. <laughs> Dawn shone faintly in the east. In the ruins of the house, only one wall remained standing. And within the wall, even as the sun rose to shine upon the burning rubble, a voice spoke again and again and again. No one would mind neither bird nor tree if mankind perished utterly. And Spring herself, when she woke at dawn, would scarcely know that we were gone, that we 
were gone. That we were gone. That we were gone. Today is April 29th, 1985. 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 Strange are the uses of providence. Is this how the end will come for mankind? With 10,000 explosions and a flash of radioactive gas? John, I told you not to eat beans. <laughs> you were so good! <laughs> so much for IHOP. <laughs> or will destruction come more subtly, extended to us gently and innocently, in, oh, let's say, the hands of a child? Okay, the hands of a child. <laughs> Who knows in what manner zero hour may arrest the world? Wait! No. I promise, if you want to save your sanity, you need to leave now. Because you thought that was bad, this is going to get interesting. Oh, God. <laughs> it was a perfect summer day Do not leave. in the year 1985. Oh, no, it wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> it was hell. Who knew it was ink in a diaper? So, I, I was. <laughs> All heading gray then. <laughs> the streets were lined with green, peaceful trees, as opposed to those other ones. <laughs> the warrior trees. Yeah, as opposed to the ants that were still in this house about that movie. Okay, businessmen sat in their quiet offices, taping their voices. Wait, don't think. Oh. <laughs> or watching televisors. The rockets hovered. Like darning needles in the blue darning. sky. I must have been really drunk in 1985. I'm Mr. Rock. Wow. <laughs> there was the universal quiet <laughs> conceit and easiness of men accustomed to peace, quite certain that there would never be war or trouble again. <laughs> this was 1985. <laughs> 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 I was there, baby. All right, there were no traitors among men, no unhappy ones. Only North. Okay, no disgruntled ones. The world was upon stable ground. Sunlit, illuminated. Sunlit? Sunlight, sorry. Look, you guys try to read this one. Sunlight, Sun, sunlight illuminated the suburbs, and the town drowsed on a tide of warm, sunlit air. And I'll Stop the World and Melt With You was a number one single. Yes. <laughs> Somewhere men were without hats. <laughs> the hats was a safety net. Yeah. 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 You're frightening children now. It's, it's passe. I a picture. On the lawns the children played. Catapult! It's <laughs> playing that. A Shouting at each other. <laughs> Holding hands, flying in circles, climbing trees, and laughing. My <laughs> mother scrapes pan in the kitchen. Wow. I didn't know pan was that bad or kinky. Alright, yes, apparently. <laughs> and in the homes, busy mothers prepared for the evening arrival of her husband. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, Mom. Good heavens, Mink. What's all this? <laughs> We're playing a game, Mommy, and well, the most exciting game ever. Please, <laughs> Mommy, tell me it's not Doctor. I don't want the game of Doctor. <laughs> Tools from Daddy's toolbox. <laughs> <laughs> Let me 